Have you ever wondered what color a mirror is? When you first think about it, it almost seems impossible to answer since a mirror reflects everything in front of it. Well, to find out the answer to this question, we first need to understand what colors are. All colors we can see are part of what we call visible light. And visible light is part of what's called the electromagnetic spectrum, which describes all kinds of light depending on frequency and wavelength. Now, natural light itself contains a spectrum of colors, including red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Each of these colors have different wavelengths, red having the longest and violet having the shortest. Our perception of color is based on the wavelengths that an object reflects or absorbs. Consider an apple. It absorbs all colors of visible light except red, which is reflected back into our eyes. This reflection gives us the perception that an apple is red. And objects that appear white reflect all wavelengths of light, whilst those that appear black absorb all wavelengths. Now that you have a basic understanding on colors, let's try to find out the color of a mirror. Based on definition, since a mirror reflects everything, you might think that a mirror is white. But if that's the case, why doesn't a plain white sheet of paper reflect images as well? The difference lies in how light is reflected off papers and mirrors. Mirrors perform something called specular reflection, following the law of reflection. This means that the angle that the light hits the mirror is equal to the angle that the light is reflected off the mirror. And the rays of light enter directly into our eyes, producing a clean, reflected image. On the other hand, paper performs something called diffuse reflection. This means that the rays of light are scattered in all directions once they hit the surface. And because these rays of light become mixed and jumbled before they enter our eyes, we perceive it as white. So what is the real color of a mirror? Well, in a modern mirror, a thin foil of either aluminum or silver is stuck to a special plane of glass known as fused quartz. This fused quartz has a higher transparency than glass, making it more suitable for a mirror. However, research has shown that a fused quartz actually reflects green stronger than other colors. So by the definition of colors we gave previously, we can actually say that the color of a mirror is slightly green. If we want to observe this phenomenon with our own eyes, we can try to put two mirrors next to each other. We will be able to observe the mirrors becoming greener and darker as they continue to reflect off of each other.